Hello all, welcome to Tech Tapture. Myself Vishal Bulbule, and in this video, we are going to see about how we can register to Terraform Associate certification exam. So, Terraform Associate is a very useful exam if you are working as a cloud architect or a infrastructure automation in any kind of cloud. It might be a AWS cloud or a Google cloud. So, to register a Terraform Associate Certification exam will uh, go to first HashiCorp official website because Terraform is a product of HashiCorp company. So I'll go to my Google Chrome and I'll just uh, type Terraform Associate Certification in Google. So it will show a first link for HashiCorp.com, so which is an official website page. So I'll go here. So HashiCorp provides few more certifications also for vault as well as console so here you could see the certifications currently the terraform associate 002 which is an active certification and you could see the 003 is a coming soon which is not yet published or available for candidates and then you could see a vault associate and vault operational proposal and one console associate so these are all certification provided by a hashicorp so we are concerned about a terraform associate 002 in this video so here you could see the title HashiCorp Infrastructure Automation Certification. So this is nothing but your Terraform Associate Certification. So you could see the Google Cloud or Cloud Engineers can use the Terraform Associate Certification to verify their basic infrastructure automation skill. So you might see this title somewhere or uh, many places, but it's nothing but a Terraform Associate Certification. So to register an exam, you can go to this button and it will redirect you to a new page there it will ask you for a github credential so to appear for these exams of a terraform associate certification you should have your github credential so if i go to the click here to go to psi exam platform so it will take you to the login page for so it will ask for a continue with a github so to appear for this exam or register for this exam you should have your own a uh, github credential if you don't have you can create a github credential so i'll just click on continue with github because i already have a github account so it will redirect me to a github login page okay i already added the credential so it just directly logged in into the account okay now here you could see there are uh, details of these a uh, page of exam so here you could see hashicorp certified console associate vault associate so already given a terraform associate so it will show in historical record so you could see i already given the terraform associate exam and i passed it so i'll just give an example of a console associate so process will be same to register for any of the hashicorp exam so i'll go for this uh, console associate and i'll go on schedule so here we need to select our country so i'll select uh, india and the time zone will be only single time zone here so i'll select asia and kolkata so there are available slots here so green you could see the slot and you can just check at the right side the available slot in particular date so on 17 there are a multiple slot for saturday if i check for any weekday so here also there are a multiple slot so you can choose your feasible date and from here you can take any of this slot so suppose i want to give exam in morning so i'll select oh suppose 8 30 am slot and i'll click on continue so it is just book my slot here so booking created successfully i'll close it now it will take us to a new payment page here if your company is providing or organization is providing you any voucher for this exam you can put a voucher code here and click on apply so you don't need to pay any kind of registration fee for this exam but if you are paying by yourself you have to pay this much of amount for this exam so i go acknowledge and i'll click on pay now so it will take us to the payment page now this will be your payment page here you have option to pay with a credit or debit card so one thing to remember here whatever details you are putting should be matching exactly on your debit or credit card even though address should be matching to your card billing address 
so that thing you should remember to avoid any kind of error while making the payment now once you made a payment on this purchase button so let me go back to a main screen so once you make a payment and you go to dashboard so i'll go to dashboard from here and once you go to dashboard this purchase option will go away and you will see option to launch exam so that launch exam button will be clickable only a 30 minute before the exam so you can log in 30 minutes before the exam and click on the launch exam button so it will take you to the psi software again which is a exam sponsor for this hashicorp exam so it will take you to the psi exam page again and it will ask you to download a psi secure browser so once you click on the download the downloading will start and it's around 350 to 400 mb of a software it will take some time to download and once downloaded you can execute that and your further exam process will be held inside that a secure browser so first it will verify your system requirement and perform some security check so some processes are prohibited like if you are recording any kind of screen sharing or a screen recording is going on it will just close that application and any other open application it will close and it performs security check on the system once that is successful then only you can proceed ahead with the exam now once a security checks are performed it will ask you to record video of your room and that video should be a 360 degree so you have to rotate your laptop throughout your room and you have to showcase there are no electronic gadgets or any kind of a notebook pens are available with you during the exam you have to also showcase a desk where you are giving your exam so for a guideline for exam test exam environment so you can go to a prepare for exam so let me go back here and i'll go to register for this exam so once you registered for the exam you will get a email with the details of the exams and handbook for giving the exams with all details so here you could see the system requirements and all details are here so you can check the details here so what should be the required id proof and more details you can see on the page now coming back to the exam pattern so i'll go back here on certification page again and you could see the exam contains a multiple choice question so one more thing so multiple choice question it doesn't mean only you will get a multiple choice so inside multiple you will get true false as well as multiple select and fill in the blanks so that is different thing for terraform exam so for fill in the blanks question you won't have any options available and you have to fill the correct answer in the input bracket so just to show you some sample i will go back here on a prepare exam and i'll show you the sample question from the official website so here you could see a sample question and here i will show you the what kind of different questions will be available so at the right side side you could see you will get true or false multiple choice multiple answer and a text match so in true or false you will see only two option true or false in multiple choice you have to select one radio but only one correct answer will be there out of four or five and in multiple answer you have to check all appropriate answer or all correct answer here it can be a multiple or it will give you in the question choose to correct so you have to choose any two if they are asking to choose any three you have to choose three correct answer and last will be a text match here you have to put a correct answer and there won't be no options available for this question type so these four question types you will see in your a multiple choice question and exam time will be one hour so which will be sufficient and there will be no issue with the time once you start exam it won't take you much like we can complete it within 45 to 50 minutes also if you are good hands on on the terraform and here are the few topics so the best way to go through each topic is you can go to this sample and you can go to the exam review here you will see a documentation on each of these topic which is on hashicorp terraform documentation so you can go through this documentation before going for this exam and your exam result will be immediately shared on your email on your screen also you will see the 
exam result as well as a percentage and you will get a certification or like certification completion email from credly as well as hashicorp on your registered gmail id so that's it for the registration process of terraform associate certification exam i will be sharing a separate video on how to prepare or how to study for this certification exam and how to pass this exam so i will share the link in the description meanwhile thank you for watching this video and all the best for your exam